hello friends welcome back to course tonight in today's video we will be watching how to export data table into a excel file in asp.net mvc so basically we will be having a data table the data and we will try to export that into a excel, excel file so what we will use here is the excel workbook and uh, which is inside the closed xml nugget package so we have to install closed xml nugget package in your application and then you will go on the controller where you want to export the data here we have to add the namespace closed xml dot excel and after you have done adding the namespace uh, you have to go to the action and this is the code which I will provide later with the video and I will explain this code for now so first of all we are getting the data which we want to export in the excel so basically this is a dummy data which I have created here so I have created a dummy table here and added some dummy rows in that so I am returning this data here into the table variable and this is excel workbook which is a part of uh, closed xml package so excel workbook basically requires a data table or data set to work on so if you provide a tab data table to uh, excel workbook then it will export that table as a worksheet so one thing to remember here is that you have to provide a name to the table for make it work because if you won't pass the name that uh, it will throw some error okay so you have to actually pass the name now if you have to export two or three sheets into the same excel file then you can create one data set here and pass the data set also but again all the tables in the data set must have some name and that name also must be unique so you cannot keep two tables with same name and add in the worksheets so here we are initializing the excel workbook and we are adding the data into the workbook now this code here is because we don't want to save the file anywhere and we will, we will just download the file as a excel file so this code will here you will pass the file name which you want to download so it will just create a file and download as a response and there are some other ways also in which you can actually save the uh, file on the server and you can download that in some other ways so but uh, here we are using it without saving the file on the server so it is actually better it saves the memory because you don't have to save it um, before downloading and now we will see it working so i will put some breakpoints and run the application so on the view part i have added one button for uh, exporting the excel that is a anchor tag and here i have mentioned the url on which i have added the code for downloading the excel so this is the button we will click on that and it will go there here you will um, get the data here in the data table and we are initializing the excel workbook giving the table name and in the worksheet you can check here is one count and it is the table one so we will just download it and you will see it has downloaded one file here and you can see that file has all the rows and table num is table one is the sheet name that we have given so that is how you can export the data and you can also provide formatting if you need you can also provide the background color color border and many more formatting options when you are using excel workbook so i will not be showing those options in the video but you can actually search excel workbook and you will find all the options there so excel workbook actually supports lots of formatting options that's why it is better for uh, excel purposes now for the code part you can actually go and search for codetonight.com which is basically our official website you can check out the blog excel export in esp.net mvc using excel workbook now in this blog you will find the code for which i have shown in the video 
so if you have any issues about the code or about downloading excel then you can comment on the video uh, you can also comment in the article uh, you can do as you like but we will be here for helping you out if you have any issue so thanks for watching guys and don't forget to share the video